Hi and welcome to my site Nottinghamshire's daily living videos. I'm Sarah, the Equipment and Communities Officer at my site and today I'm going to talk to you a little bit about handheld magnification. So once you um, have maybe been diagnosed with a visual impairment, you may be eligible um, to get a magnifier on loan through your low vision clinic at the hospital. Um, alternatively, you may decide you want to buy a handheld magnifier. There is lots of different ones out there and I want to just talk to you about some of the core things that are useful to know or to look for in a handheld magnifier. So the first thing I want to talk about is lighting. Lighting is essential when you have a visual impairment in most situations. So a magnifier that has its own inbuilt light would be a great addition because it will shine directly on the document you are reading. Now, the other thing that confuses a lot of people is the size of a lens of a magnifier. So the basic rule for this is the stronger the magnifier, the smaller the lens. A magnification can start around 1.5 and can, on a whole in handheld magnifiers, go up to 15 times. Now, the lower magnifications tend to come in either a rectangle, so this is a 3.5, or a circle, this is a 5 times. So, both of these have got inbuilt lights. I don't really want to shine this at the camera just to give you an idea. There we go. So as you can see, they're not huge magnifiers, but they do give quite a big, what we call field of vision. Now, as they get stronger, so this is a 10 times, I'm going to compare it with the circular one to give you an idea you can see that it is much smaller. And therefore, instead of full words, you may only get um, letters um, through the lens and then you've got to try and pair them all together. On a whole, once you get to sort of a seven times and above, that is when the lenses become much smaller. Up to about a six, you will pretty much get that sort of larger circular. And for the rectangle, it tends to be around the four times when um, that is the maximum that you will get a, a rectangular magnifier. So I'm hoping that little explanation um, clarifies why you cannot get 15 times magnifiers with a bigger lens. It's just not practical um, to make them. It just doesn't exist. Um, so, like I said, this video was to cover handheld magnifiers, but in one of the um, next video um, videos that I'm doing, I am going to show you what we call um, handheld video magnifiers, and these pieces of equipment just sort of like take the next step up from a handheld magnifier. If you have any questions about handheld magnifiers, want to have a look at them, please do not hesitate to contact the main office and uh, I will do my best to explain to you about them or um, do a magnification assessment to see what level you are at. Hope you enjoyed that video and until the next time, goodbye. Handheld magnifiers start at £35. To arrange a magnification assessment, contact my site NOPS on 0115 9706 806.